dance beautiful people happy new year my beautiful people happy happy new year we made it 2024 Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. my first video in 2024 oh my gosh i just i'm so thankful so grateful to each and every one of you guys and i would love to hear how did you guys celebrate your 2024 what is your new year's resolution you know for 2024 uh just let me know let me know so this video as you can see by the title okay um i'm going to just kind of you know be a bit it's a bit of a freestyle okay it's a bit of uh, my resolution my new year's resolution and also what to expect from this channel from dance beautiful people um in 2024 okay um so <laughs> i just like like so um in 2024 guys okay it's very important for me in 2024 because um i felt like in 2023 i kind of was trying to figure a lot of things out and i wasn't sure okay but in 2024 it's very important for me to remain in my sauce yes i made this video okay i made this video um a few months back and you you could go back and you will see it um and i i'll probably put the link up here it says what is your sauce okay in 2024 it's very important for me to find my niche all right to find a group of people who really believe in what I am um, sharing to the world, okay? I really want my, really my hardcore followers, like I pray for God to really help me to find um, those like-mindedness, okay? People who are like-minded like me. Because I believe, I know, and I accept the fact that, you know, not, not everybody is for you. Your message cannot penetrate everybody. And I'm really am satisfied with that. I'm okay with it. I just need my people. My I, I need my people to be attracted to me. And I need to attract my people. Because I feel like um throughout the years okay in um because this is my fourth year this channel this january of 2020 was when i started my youtube channel okay and uh now we are in 2024 so this is four years now i've been doing this for four years so i'm not new to this okay and throughout the four years i kind of you know been going around trying to figure out and trying to find my niche okay and trying to please some people, you know, try, trying to say, okay, maybe I should look like this or talk like that or do this or do that. But in 2024, guys, I'm telling you, I am not, a, I am going to be unapologetically me, okay? I am, I am not apologizing for being me. I am not going to care. I don't care. I'm going to be true to myself. I'm going to, you know, find my sauce, all right? And remain in my sauce. Like I, I know what my sauce is, but I feel like in social media, sometimes we're trying to, you know, please other people. No, 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 no. I'm going to stay true to myself. And then I know that my true, you know, believers, subscribers, followers, supporters will find me. Okay. My group will find me and I will find them. Now that being said, who is Dance Beautiful People? Who am I? Who, who, who is this girl huh? in front of you? I know I have had several new subscribers in the last few weeks, all right? Now, one thing I want to share, all right, is that I am a Christ lover. I am a Jesus Christ lover, and I believe in Jesus Christ, all right? Now, that being said, if you haven't noticed already, by my Instagram, uh, TikTok, um, even here in my videos, I am not your typical Christian woman. <laughs> and throughout my life, okay, and especially these last four years, and I have talked to my family about that, it's like, 
I try at times, I try to please, you know, people from my church, you know, people at church, people from my study groups, you know, um, I'm, it's like, I, I try to, you know, be certain way that I really am not, you know, and, um, in 2024, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I can only be me. And that being said, um, oftentimes, um, people feel like for you to love Jesus Christ, for you to have a relationship with Christ, you have to look a certain way. You have to dress a certain way. You have to be a certain way, but that's not me y'all. Okay. I love the big, you know, extension hair, you know, curly. I love the flawless makeup. Mm. I love, you know, being a woman, you know, have a little cleavage. What? Did you say that? Oh yeah, she said it. <laughs> oh my God. You see what I mean? Do you see what I mean? So me, you know, um, embracing my womanhood, me embracing my femininity, all right? Like me liking to wear false eyelashes, makeup, my nails, my dresses, my looks, all right? How does that take away from me being any less of a Christian? These are all religion, okay? These are all what people say. You know what I'm saying? Follow the Bible. Follow the Ten Commandments, okay? When Moses was writing the Ten Commandments, that shall not commit adultery, that shall not lie, that shall not steal, that shall not kill. Tell me where it said, that shall not wear false eyelashes. And so on. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I'm done. In 2024, y'all, for all of my Christian ladies, okay, who have a relationship with Christ, who read your Bible and love Jesus Christ and try hard to follow the Bible and, and at the same time, mm, likes to look glammed up I'm your girl mm -hmm. I'm your girl mm -hmm. I'm your girl who likes to go on vacation and rock that bikini because you've been working hard eating um salad hmm exercising and you are on that you are on that beach you are at the pool with your husband with your fiance, with your committed boyfriend, and you want to wear that bikini, and at the end, at the same time, you are a Christ lover, you are a woman of God in a bikini. Mm, that's me. I am your girl. Okay, I am your girl. Mm -hmm. This is it. This is it. This is me. All right. This is done beautiful people. That's how I am. All right. <laughs> I'm telling you, I don't care. 2024, I have to be me. I have to be me and be my sauce. That's it. Okay? So, yes. So, my New Year's resolution, one of them is, you know, being authentically me and not trying to fit in into what anybody thinks that I should be looking like and sounding like and be like and acting like. Okay? That's one. Number two, y'all. Okay? is growing and that relates to number one i want to grow my brand i want to grow beautiful people dance beautiful people i, I want to be more committed to you guys meaning that i want to share content more okay share um more frequently share more videos and that being said you guys already know that every single friday i am committed to putting out a video out there every single friday all right. So I want to really, because I'm passionate about making videos. I love, love, love getting all made up and, you know, um, making these videos for you guys. And speaking of getting all made up, I am also going to be posting a lot about, you know, my, my before and after. Okay. How do I, how I transform from before and after. 
all right um so yes and i'm and i have a big surprise for you guys in 2024 also all right stay tuned okay i'm, I'm just going to be creating more and more videos i'm just a creator i'm very passionate about that in 2024 also y'all i'm gonna be sharing more about my love life Woo -hoo -hoo, my love life stay tuned guys stay tuned now um you know i am a private person i know i know i am i'm out there i put myself out there but at the same time i'm very private and my significant other um like he doesn't mind you know me talking about us but he's also private you know um he's like he he wants our you know relationship to be for us you know for us but at the same time i'm like look i am an influencer i'm a content creator i'm a youtuber i need to share with with my beautiful people right and he's like, all right, babe, just, you know, share. But at the same time, keep in mind, you know, certain things have to be private, which I understand. You know what I'm saying, y'all? You know, I, I get it. But that being said, y'all going to be seeing more videos about us in 2024. Um, I'm going to share with you guys. All right. And stay tuned. I'm going to make that video. I don't know exactly when in 2024 I'm going to make it. I'll I'll try to make it in the next few months or weeks. You just got to stay tuned and get subscribed to know. I'm going to tell you guys how I how I got engaged. Yes, your girl got engaged in less than a year. All right? I'm going to share it with you. Now, I just want to let you know that to be able to get engaged in less than a year you need to be com be a complete single yes you need to be a whole single you need to be happy with your single life and this is why i am i am doing a lot of things i i am creating a lot of content i am creating a lot of videos about being a happy single being a complete single being a whole single because if you're not happy as a single person you i want you to be able to be if you're not happy as a single person okay you're not going to be able to attract the love of your of your life in a short period of time you're going to keep on wasting your time okay and i want to really watch my videos guys because i'm going to help you all right to focus your time so that you can bang bang don't waste your time out there dating for six a year ten years five years with no ring what the heck is that with no benefits no so but in order for you to have your policies, your boundaries, your procedures, which I often talk about, you need to be a complete single person. You need to be a whole single. All right. But stay tuned, y'all. Stay tuned. I'm going to talk a lot about that. Follow me on Instagram. All right. Follow me on Instagram. You'll see snippets, snippets of, you know, um, videos and motivational quotes that I put daily. I'm telling you, Dungeon of People, I am going to open up to you guys a whole lot in 2024, okay? And of course, of course, um, the third thing, my New Year's resolution is to continuing to be the great mom that I am to my son, a great mom, you know, to continuing to ask God for great health, Okay, great health, y'all, because without health, you have nothing. I am a hospice nurse. You, you guys know this about me. If you don't, well, I'm sharing that with you. Um, I'm pretty sure you probably know that because I have a lot of videos about hospice care. I am a hospice nurse, okay? I've been a hospice nurse for over 10 years. And I know that your health is number one. All right, with, without it, you can't do nothing. So I continue to pray God, you know, for great health. Speaking of health, guys, oh my God, you don't want to miss this. Um, in April, see, I'm telling you guys everything that's coming up with those beautiful people, right? In April, I am going to be 
posting about my health journey. Okay, if you want to lose weight, right now, y'all, right now, I am not at my best weight. Okay, your girl has gained about 10 pounds since the summer. Okay, since July, I've gained about 10 pounds, all right? And the holidays was not helping any, any, mm, too many good food during the holidays, okay? So, but anyhow, I am right now doing this really healthy challenge, this healthy challenge that I call it, okay? Um, and I'm going to, and I am documenting everything as we speak. I am filming everything because I want in this, um, in April, okay, April, my birthday month, I'm going to release it to you guys, all right? I'm going to show you guys how you can easily lose these stubborn pounds, all right, and look your best. So stay tuned, y'all. Stay tuned, all right? Stay tuned. You don't want to miss it. I don't want to release it now or show it now because I feel like I'm kind of vulnerable, okay? And that's another thing that I want to teach you guys about. When you are a public person, okay, like, you know, such as me or anybody who does YouTube or, you know, who create videos and post it out and talk about your life, things like that. When you are a public person, it's very important for you to be mentally strong, okay? When you are talking about something, you cannot talk about it. You cannot talk about something that happened right now. You have to heal. That's the word. You have to heal from your trauma before you can um, provide somebody with teaching, with feedback. Do you understand? So if I right now, okay, if I am not 100% happy with you know certain things about me, I cannot teach about it. I have to wait Okay, wait until I'm happy about it and then I'll go ahead and teach. Get it? So in April, four months from now, if God's willing, and if I um, stick to it, I'm going to be a completely, I'm going to transform. I'm going to be happy about, about the results, okay, that I'm working on within my body. And I'm going to share with you guys everything. All right. So yeah, so those are my three New Year's resolution, all right, guys, is to be me, be me, the me that God created, work on growing my brand, Dance Beautiful People, all right, and continuing to be, you know, just upgrade, you know, a great mom, you know, health, love, financial freedom, you know, all that greatness, all right? Um, and of course, you know, have Jesus Christ in the center. Jesus Christ, my Lord Jesus Christ in the center of every single thing that I do, every single thing, from the moment that I wake up to the moment that I go to sleep, all right? So my beautiful people, I want to hear about your New Year's resolution. Share with me, what is your New Year's resolution? Um, what are you hoping you know, 2024 will look like? What are you committed to in 2024? Hmm? Share with your girl. I love you as always with the love of Jesus Christ. All right. See you in the next video. Dance, beautiful people. See ya.